the way she came with. That's my opportunity. Yeah. You had it all going on. Now. I feel like I need to be holding a mic and just bam. Drop, drop that. The mic. She was pretty good. She, she was, was pretty good. good. I like the fellow before her though. You know, giving without thinking about yes. getting anything back. That's pretty yes. good. Yes. And you know what? Fuck. All of these contestants are really good. It's going to be hard. It's going to be hard. Choice. It's it's hard. I'm glad that we're not judging, right? <laughs> okay. Switching gears. Kalani Pea is the voice behind E Valea, a modern Hawaiian album released just over a month ago. On August 5th, the album hit number one on the iTunes Music World Charts and shortly after hit number 12 on the Billboard World Album Charts. Kalani is from Panaewa in Hilo and the island of Hawaii and joins us live in studio with more on his music. Kalani, thank you so much for being here. For this what was your inspiration for this album? Well, this album really defines and demonstrates who I am as a Hawaiian, as a Kanaka, a contemporary soulful artist, being able to perpetuate Hawaiian language my entire life as a Hawaiian immersion graduate. I wanted to incorporate mele that really defines our kupuna and defines who I am as a modern art artist with a little hollow bow tie. <laughs> I love the bow tie, by the way. But we got to listen a little bit during your sound check, oh, and you can hello. tell that you sing with a lot of passion. Oh. Um, what is your background? How did you get into singing? Well, I had a really bad speech impediment. I stuttered and stammered so much as a keiki, as a child. So oh. my mom and my dad, who are musicians, introduced me to talent competitions, like karaoke competitions, <laughs> all of that. Disney music and, and being able to sing at such an early age inspired me to sing as a tenor, you know, and be able to share my, my melee through. That is such an interesting yeah, story yeah, because yeah. when people have that kind of speech impediment or whatever, yes. usually they would go and yeah. hide. But instead, mm -hmm. your parents motivated you, inspired you to yeah. share your talents. Sometimes you got to take it head on. They saw, me, yeah. Yeah. Right. They they saw me singing in front of a mannequin at JC Betty's, and they're like, ah, I think he likes music. <laughs> Maybe his speech therapy didn't help me. So <laughs> it was music that helped me. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. And we can tell, you know, through your singing that your grasp of the Hawaiian language oh, is oh, amazing. Oh, you know, just when to put the Reflections and oh, intonations. It's it's a joy to hear you really tell those stories. You're not just singing a song. Oh, we need to tell our story. And that's Aye. what's important. Mm -hmm. That's a vai vai. That's important. So where can people get your music? You, they can log on to my website, kalanipeamusic.com, um, where you can follow my musical journey. Okay. Yeah. And after this appearance, you're heading, you're, you're just Straight heading today. Home to Maui. Um, <laughs> yes, I am the Olelo Hawaii judge. Um, on, at the Uncle Richard Hall P.E. Falsetto competition, so I'm excited to hear wonderful talent tonight. Oh, is great. Maui home for you? Maui's home now. <gasps> Maui is no ka oi, but Big Island. Oh. Yeah, Big Island's great. I was going to oh, say, Maui when you said beautiful. Maui, I'm like, yes. I knew I loved you from the beginning. <laughs> Maui no ka oi. Yeah. Oh, mahalo. Right. Well, thank you so much for being here and for sharing your mahalo talents with us. I'm grateful to be here. Mahalo. Will, will you please perform again for us? I will give it to you. Okay, yes. all right, let's move on. <laughs> thank you.